Hello dear student welcome to my youtube channel in this video we will see practical number 12 exporting table queries forms and report to xml format so this practical it is from computer application in pharmacy subject code bp 210p so i will show you the demo it is very similar like an earlier practical practical number 11 where we have saved it as an web page or html page so similar way we want to uh, export the data into an xml so like the video and subscribe the channel for more updates so before that one should know what is an xml so it is extensive markup language uh, x see x it is because this x uh, in extensive uh, we can see x so that is why x it has been utilized extensive and m for markup and l for language so this xml form it is important for designing of an web page see this data what we have uh, we have learned in earlier practical also how to create this data uh, so uh, the data that i have so i can uh, go to this main menu bar and from there i can export it uh, to the information tab whatever it has been required uh, but best way is that uh, go to the patient information uh, click right on it so, so once you click right on it then export it and once you click on export you will file the xml extension so xml extension just click on it so once you click on it choose the destination folder so i have choose the destination folder already uh, so this was my destination folder and patient information i will uh, tag it as patient information xml whatever the name you can uh, you want you can give it just save it once you save it click on okay so once you click on okay so check these boxes data xml scheme of data x uh, sd and just press okay so there is no need to go for more options just press it okay so once you press it okay uh, press on this save export steps and press okay now you can see that data it has been saved in the format that is xml Uh, so i will show you how that data looks like uh, so this is the data xml uh, whatever we have saved just now and if you want to open the data see this data it has been opened in the form of an uh, like it is not an exactly an html uh, but it opens uh, like an html format so just i will show you how it looks like so that will be helpful when you are creating any website Uh, for that purpose it will be helpful so here you can see the data which is been appearing uh, so in this data uh, you so in this data you can see that so in this data you can see that patient information so it was the table of an patient information and whatever the tags we have utilized in case of an html so these are similar kind of an tags but not exactly similar but opening of a document and closing of document see like patient information this table it has been opened and here it has been closed like id id it is opened and for closing we are using this closing tab uh, so one it is id and in between so just this one it will appear when you will uh, utilize it for a web page so id uh, it is so id after that name so name uh, the patient name it is vikram and after that again you are closing with the closing tag of an html so similar way the data you can see everywhere uh, in this uh, file uh, it is like closing and opening of a document in html Uh, so this is an one of an advantage of an xml that we can utilize the tags that we want uh, like uh, there is no need of a body uh, or what we utilize in case of an html so this 
so this was the practical just take a print of it and submit it that you have exported data uh, to the xml format so thank you for watching the video if you are having any doubts you can comment me in the comment box section